African booty scratcher. African booty scratcher. African booty scratcher. Black cockroach. Being an African born in America, you get called everything on the list. In high school, I didn't see anything positive about identifying as an African. The impression of what Africa is and where I must have come from was completely different. Growing up as a first generation child in America, you kind of live like a double life. live in a Sierra Leonean household, you're Sierra Leonean until you live in Sierra Leone. In Sierra Leone, my American aspect is a given, and you see that no matter how much I try to conceal it, that's what people see first before they see that I'm Sierra Leone. It's like a fine line that you have to get your identity together. You got the way you talk with your friends. You have the way you talk with your parents. And now that we're growing up as educated individuals, we have to learn how to speak in a professional setting. Be able to be a chameleon sometimes and be in both places. I always question myself, like, what can I do to make it right or make me right? Good enough for you guys to say, okay, you know what, she's Nigerian. Or, okay, you know, she's American. You kind of find yourself in the middle. You don't really identify with African Americans. You try to, but your life is just so much more different. And in terms of the African perspective, you're still caught in the middle.